Hey guys, today we are going to be doing an analyst of the Wisconsin Center race because this has been getting a lot of attention in the media recently, so I do think it is an appropriate time to make a video about this. Now, this is a really interesting Senate race in Wisconsin. The incumbent senator is the, a Republican, and his name is Ron Johnson. He's very disliked among people, and the Dem the Democratic nominee is Medella Barnes, the current lieutenant governor under Tony Evers, and state senator um, before that and an activist. Now, I feel like this is an interesting Senate race because, you know, Wisconsin is usually close with its elections, but Ron Johnson right now is really favored in the polls. Not in the polls, but he's really favored in the Senate race. If we can, look, but the polls are showing Mandela Barnes is doing really well. But these polls are probably trash. Like, look at this. This is not going to happen. Like, it has a toss-up on classic mode, for, like 50-50. And for Deluxe, it's not even that bad. And Mandela Barnes and his oh. campaign oh, is very interesting. Because he's trying to appeal to moderate voters and purple voters in Wisconsin. While he's also trying to appeal to this progressive vote in Milwaukee and Madison and stuff like that. While winning both and like getting turnout get, uh, with progressive voters. And that's very... Like, the campaign strategy isn't bad, but when you run it, he's going to be... He's a very progressive person. He's green. He supports the... the what is it? Ugh, the global warming thing. He is very progressive. He's AOC if he was a male, to be honest. He is very progressive. I mean, John... The only thing about this that would make Ron Johnson really do bad is Ron Johnson the thing about Ron Johnson is that he's very disliked in Wisconsin but Mandela Barnes is just not a good candidate he really sucks he's just one of the worst candidates in this whole entire cycle for Democrats like abortion abortion is not going to help him too much Wisconsin doesn't really care in my opinion about it Wisconsin is one of the swing states that it still might have a little effect, maybe sway a little bit, like 0 0.5, maybe, in Wisconsin. But Mandela Barnes is just not a good candidate. If we look at polls, these polls are terrible. Wisconsin polls are really um, infamous for their terrible polls. Um, as you can see, Barnes, four, seven points. Nelson, that guy won by one. Ron Johnson by three points. This is the only poll. This was Ron Johnson winning. There's not any other. Two, number one, all these polls are really bad. Half of these, okay, so these are all, okay, Barnett's leading by four, seven, two, even. This is even, even the most based one, or this one right here. These polls are just really bad. Mandela Barnes is not going to win. Yes, polls are showing him doing well, but this is the same state as Wisconsin that gave Hillary thought Hillary Clinton was going to win by four points. The point in Wisconsin absolutely sucks. We, we need to recognize that I think polls are a good indication of the races, except in Wisconsin, to be honest. Wisconsin polls suck. Any other polls are better than Wisconsin. They really are bad. Polls, I think, are a small indication, except for Wisconsin. If you look in the Wisconsin governor's race, which is a other swing state and very other competitive state, if you look at this, there is not one single poll showing the Republicans winning. This one, there's even one that has Evers winning by 17 points. This is a state that... It's just not going to go to Republicans anytime soon, and it's sad to admit it, but it's not a state that, it's just not going to happen necessarily. But, now I'll also say, if we can look at some of this, it has becoming, oops, sorry, this is the governor's, but if you look at this, this is becoming a state that Ron Johnson was doing very well in, and I feel like that's how it should stay, and Mandela Barnes was just trailing behind him at this point. But now you can see, the chances of winning the seats are very close. And now, this is considered a toss-up race. So this is a close state, no doubt about it. Ron, like, Mandela Barnes can win, maybe. He does have a chance of winning. 
But right now, this is a state that I think will go five points to Ron Johnson. This is a very... This is a, Wisconsin only went to Biden by 0. 0.9 points. That's almost a point, but that's less than a percentage. And Wisconsin is going to the Republicans more than ever. So I just don't see a progressive candidate like Mandela Barnes winning in Wisconsin overall against an incumbent Republican senator in a year that is favoring the Republicans. Tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. Do you agree with my commentary on this race? Do you think the polls in Wisconsin are accurate? Because if you do, that's kind of funny, not going to lie. Um, do you think uh, Ron Johnson will lose because of his likability? Tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. If you're not, like the video and comment. And wait, I already said that. If there's a video you want me to make, I will make it. Likely, I make basically most of the videos requested. So, if you want me to make more videos, tell me in the comments, and I will do that suggestion. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon.